Hi. So, do we have two on yesterday or one on? I don't know the person. Okay. In the next month, my breakdowns are going to start. Okay. So, Ali and Paul. Two more chapters. Okay. Next month, right? Next month. <laughs> Not next week. Big terms means your, uh, uh, your you have you had your unit test that twenty marks paper. Yeah. Okay. So now you have full eighty marks. Okay. And uh, so should we do villa for sale today? No, it's it's gonna come. Of course. Uh, one, two, three. We have done three lessons, two poems so far. So we will do villa for sale. And uh, what all will be coming from uh, the other book? Nothing. Nothing. <laughs> Did you have the first lesson? I have that portion. Yes. We have in grammar, notice writing, informal writing, and paragraph writing, integrative exercises, and uh, in paragraph writing we have done. There are three different types: descriptive writing that we have done. How I taught my grandmother to read done. The book done. A dormant tube done. The road not taken done. Yeah. The solitary paper is uh, remaining. Yeah. Okay. Villa for sale is remaining. Okay. Seven ages is remaining. Okay, you have seven ages also. Fine. Right. The man who That is also done. Three are uh, remaining. Yeah. Okay. Fine. So, that is doable. And nothing from the other book? So that book is never there for the exams? It would be there, but the, I mean, this is, I think, only for the first term and second term will be that book. But the second term, they continue with this, no? Yeah, I'm just they, wondering. <laughs> so, compared, are coming now. so, compared to the other book, you have very little. Therefore, I'm wondering. So, the, yeah. They have like two full books, so nothing from that book comes at price. In this book, they are doing that book also. So, is it coming? I'm not sure. Will you do Villa for sale? No, but Sorry? I'm, I'm not here. I don't know. It's not come yet. He said he will come. He usually comes. So, we finish this day. Why do we have so many chapters? Yeah, that's what. No, in English, eight. In Sanskrit, I have four chapters and eleven grammar part. Yeah, yeah, Sanskrit has a lot of grammar. English also has a lot of grammar, but. Uh, mm. And this all we have to do for IT. Okay. Why? We have seven chapters in maths. What is three? Is two? Is two? Eight chapters for science. In social sciences too. We are not even touched. Social sciences, you'll have many lessons, lengthy ones, right? Hmm. But it's interesting, it's like story, so is it a bit? Yeah. So you sign on this for now. Siddhi. If I don't know how it comes, we can easily start. Uh, Villa for sale. Have you read this? Have yeah, you read no, this? No, Then we'll do this drama. Then we'll go to solid oh, page. Page. page number 103. 103 introduces. Hey, you have solitary reefer and seven inches. Oh. So four poems, huh? No. Yeah. Seven pages is a poem. Yeah, seven pages, solitary reefer, and this the last three only. 
Oremos. Uh, poetry, how I the group. No, 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 no. No, no, no. For exam, you have four poems. So you have four poems, three lessons, one rest. Hi, one draft. What's drama? What's drama? Drama section, this is a play. Oh, yeah. Uh, the villa for the uh, for sale. We started keeping it from Hannah in high school. What do it? Keeping it from Hannah. We started that in high school. Is that even coming for your exam? The other book is coming? Keeping yeah. it from Hannah for literature. No, no, no. What I'm telling is, is that other uh, lessons from keeping keeping it from Hannah. Oh, PJ Woodhouse. Yes, and that we, are, we just started the next video. But is it going to come to Yeah, probably. Then what? They are going to do the whole book or what? In for the midterm? No, they are not going to do the whole book for the midterm. How many chapters are going to be? No, I think uh, it's just going to be like the first four chapters. Yeah, yeah. 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 Next week. Oh, we have next month. Next month. Okay. When are yours? Um, ours. My my was next month, September. There will be definitely one drama. So let's finish Villa for sale. Then we'll go for solitary leaper because three three poems. There will be three three poems. Okay. So how much have we done? We were actually waiting for you so that we don't have to restart. So if you so this is a place. There's literature, there's poetry, and then you have drama. So it's a play written, and uh, it's an interesting play. There are four main characters. Uh, one is Juliet. She is the owner of the villa. The other one is her maid. Third one is Gaston. Gaston. Gaston is a businessman who has come to see the villa. He wanted to purchase the villa. Then his wife, Jian. Jian was very keen on buying this villa. And then there is one Mrs. Al Smith. She is an American woman, uh, a rich American lady who has a small role to play in this thing. Okay. So we will divide the characters. Yeah, we will divide the characters. So the scene represents the salon of a small villa near Nogent Sar Mail. Now, the very long. Yes, but it's an easy, it's interesting it's one. We get that, but then the salon. Yeah, not sure, but at least we'll try to finish. Yeah, we need to buy it now, so it's easy. Try to finish reading at least. Five, six, seven, eight. It's just about nine, ten, eleven. It's eleven pages. Plus exercise. Yeah, plus exercise. Yeah. Yeah. So we can't do definitely. We can't do it today. Yeah, one one. I think eight minutes from one hour is also very good. Nine minutes to eight minutes to eleven. So when the curtain rises, the maid and Juliet are discovered. So the curtain rises, and on the stage there is this maid and Juliet. So uh, will you be maid? And can she be Juliet? How many characters are there? First, there are, there is first yeah. two pages is only maid and Juliet. Then we we'll divide it into again uh, after the Gaston and Jean part. Yeah. So then you can be Gaston, she can be Jean. Okay. And you will be Gaston. And I'll be. Gaston. Okay. Yeah. I'll be Mrs. Uh, Mrs. But uh, there is time for two weeks. Yes. So let's first start. Should I tell you the story or you would like to discover it as you yes, yeah. is okay. You have done this test. But they have it in their portion for the exam. We are not born at home. So but definitely one drama will be there. But how will we complete this drama when we already started keeping it from an exam in next month? So I don't I'm not sure if this <laughs> let's do. If it doesn't come, then it will come for the next term. Who's made? Let's start. Uh, 
Uh, what madam is sorry? It's madam. It's madam. It's madam. Oh, it's madam. Uh, it's French. It's madam. It's not French. Yeah, this is like it's based in France. So, uh, but you're free to go. Okay. It's very in English. Okay, okay. Not at all. Mind you, if someone had bought it on the very day I placed it for sale. Then I might have felt sorry because I would have wondered if I hadn't been a fool to sell at all. But the sign has been hanging on the gate for over a month now, and I am be beginning to be afraid that the day I bought it was when I was a real fool. Do you mind if I just read it just for a second? Sorry, sorry. What did you say? Uh, do you mind if I just read it just for a second? Yeah. So the maid asks if she is sorry. Sorry for what? Sorry for what? That um, she bought the house. Or she is selling the house. You know, are you feeling sorry for selling the villa? So Juliet says, then not at all. Had she bought a client, somebody to buy the villa the day she placed it for sale. Then she would have thought, "Arey, it's a mistake." It's a mistake, sir. Because we were asked to do it. Exactly. Like the day she, the day she put the advertisement, there is a big queue for it. But then it so happened that it's been, but the sign has been hanging for a month. And now she's in that field. Yeah. Buying it. Buying it. And nobody is there to buy the villa. Nobody is even, you know, coming to offering to offer any. Price so or she, even she in just, what? She's just saying that she's a fool leader. <laughs> so now she thinks that now now she thinks. In fact, she thinks that was it a was, was it a foolish decision? Yeah, yeah. To buy the villa in the first place. Okay. All the same, madam. Uh, when they brought you the for sale sign, you weren't let them put it up. You waited until it was mine. Then you went and hung it yourself. I know. You see, I thought that. As they could, as they could not leave it in the dark, the house would belong to me for one more night. I was so sure that the next day the entire world would be fighting to purchase it. For the first week, I was annoyed every time I passed that villa for sale sign. The neighbors seemed to look at me in such a strange kind of way that I began to think the whole thing was going to be much more of a sell than a sale. That was a month ago, and now I have only one thought: that is, that is to get the wretched place, place uh, wretched place of my hands. I would sacrifice it at any price, one hundred thousand francs, if necessary, and that's only twice what it cost me. I thought I would get two hundred thousand, but I suppose I must cut my loss. Besides, in the past few weeks, four people almost bought it. So I have begun to feel as though it no longer belongs to me. Oh, I am fed up with the place because nobody really wants it. What time did those agency people say the lady would call? Okay. So you understood. Between yeah. four and five. Then we must wait for her. It is a nice little place for you to spend the weekends now. Yes, but times are hard and business is as bad as it can be. In that case, ma'am, is it a good time to sell? No, perhaps not. But still, there are moments in life when it's the right time to buy, but it's never the right time to sell. For fifteen years, everybody has that money at the same time, and nobody wanted to sell. Now, nobody has any money, and nobody wants to buy. But still, even so, it would be funny if I couldn't manage to sell a place here, a stone's throw from Georgeville, the French Hollywood. When I when all, all I am asking is a paltry hundred thousand. Okay, so you understood so so far the discussion. So How much was a hundred thousand francs be? So now this was uh, this is the story written in uh, as far as not. Some hundred years back, so uh, well, the prices then and the prices now. 
won't match. So, oh, yeah. oh, so that's what almost a hundred years ago. So the so she decides that. I was going to ask the surprise because they're calling 100,000 as one. She's calling 100,000. She's saying, oh, just 100,000 francs. She wanted 200,000. It's a villa that she decided, she decided to sell. And then she says that uh, the maid says that did she hang the uh, sign immediately? Actually, no. The day she got the sign, villa for sale sign, she waited for that day and she hung it on the oh, night. night in the night she, in the night she went on outside and she herself hung it and why did she do that because she wanted one more uh, like the actually her ex-boyfriend to be sold really quickly and she wanted to own it for one more day. yeah she wanted to own it for one more day she thought that anyway she goes and puts the sale sign in the and night people will not be able to read it but she, she ends up being very she wanted, how much money did she want? She was 100, 200. 200 and now she has decided. Now she only wants 100,000 and she is supposed to get the place out of the Because it's been a month, almost four people almost bought it. But and then the yes, deal so did not work. She yeah. thinks that no one wants it and now she really doesn't oh, yeah. And she needs money. She needs money. So now she's desperate probably to sell the house. That reminds me, there is a favor I want to ask you, madam. Yes, what is it, my lord? Will you be kind enough to let me off between 9 and noon tomorrow morning? No, Where is this house, by the way? See, the location is very good. good. So, this location is very good. It is so from, jo from Joinville. Yeah, Joinville. That is the French Hollywood. That is French Hollywood. Sorry, what?
Some people have the outer look. If you don't want that. I will. If you would go and see them with their hair slipped back the way you do when you are dressing, man, I'm sure they will invade you right away. Because really, man, you look too possible. Is that a compliment or a <laughs> No, we really don't know whether it's a commission. We take it as a compliment. And she's a Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. The bell rings. I'm going upstairs for a moment. If that is the lady, tell her I will not be long. It won't do. It won't do to give her the yeah. impression that I am waiting for her. See, she, she, is, she says that she will go up and she will wait there. Because it doesn't look good, no, that uh, the person who's come to buy the house, the, the lady who's selling herself opens the door. That looks that she's too desperate. So she, she doesn't want to show that she's too desperate to sell the villa. So she'll go and she'll come back down after 10 minutes and then she'll start. As if, you know, nobody is in a hurry. Just to show that, pretend. Very well, madam. Exit oh. Juliet as she runs off to open the front door. Oh, if I could pick up a red card, why can't I? She says, oh, if I could become a okay, Greta Garbo, why can't I? Oh, so it's like uh, Greta Garbo is, yeah, she was an actress. So it's your name, she was an actress. Yeah, she was a... Yeah, she, wants to, she wants to be like... Like, like... She wants to be like... Yeah, it's like uh, Molly Monroe, she was the Molly Monroe of that time. Or what do you say, who's the most popular today? Hollywood actress. Yeah. Whoever it is. Our most popular Hollywood actor, actress. Actress. Yeah. I have no idea. You have no idea. Okay. Maybe Scarlett Johansson. That's the one I know. That's the one you know. Okay, fine. So one of the top famous Hollywood actresses. Just like if she acts in the movies and one day she turns out to be as famous as Greta Garbo, then why not? Why not take a chance? Why you don't like Jennifer Lawrence? Yeah, I like it. Uh, no, I don't see that many movies. Yeah, okay. Uh, can you read the uh, Boys is heard of a second later. The maid returns showing in Gaston and Gia. What? Oh, that's right. Uh, if you will be kind enough to sit down, I'll tell you Thank you. The maid is. Now I guess I'll be Gaston and she. Okay, we'll be Gaston and she can be Gia. And they call that a garden. Why? It's a yard with a patch of grass. But the inside of the house seems very nice. Gaston, who's Gaston? Now, Gaston and Jan, this is a couple. Okay, and they have come to see the villa. They wanted to buy the villa. Okay, so agency, she says, you know, those people from agency. So she had contacted this agency, you know, estate agency, the way we have who sell and buy, help people buy and sell the house. 25 yards of Kriton and a dash of pain. You can't you can get that anywhere. That's not fair. Wait until you see the rest of it. Why should I? I don't want to see it at the kitchen to know that the garden will mention that the salon is impossible. What's the matter with it? Matter? Why can't you call it a salon? Perhaps there is another. Never mind the other, I'm talking about this one. Salon, you know what a salon is, right? A yeah. uh, front room or a living room is the salon. Oh, Never mind the other, I'm, I'm talking about this one. We could do something very original with it. Yes, make it an annex to the garden. No, but a kind of study. A study? Good lord, you're not thinking of going for studying, right? Don't be silly, you know perfectly well what a modern study is. No, I don't. Hmm. Well, well uh, it, it, it's a place where, where one gathers. Where one gathers what? Don't be aggravated. Please, if you don't want the house, tell me so at once and we will say no more about it. I told you before he crossed the road that important. As soon as you see a mirror for sale sign, 
You have to go and say that please don't know. But we are buying a villa and we No we are saying we are not. What do you mean we are not? Then we are not looking for a villa. Certainly not. This is an idea you have stuck in your head for the past month. But we talk about nothing else. You mean you have talked about nothing else? I've never talked to already. You see, you have talked about it so much that you thought that we are, we are talking. You haven't even noticed that I've never joined in the conversation. You say that you're looking for Villa, and that's it. You need to go slow. You need to go slow. Read slowly. No, I'm pretty sure Gaston will be uh, speaking the same way I am. Yes, yes. I'm, I'm, yes, I'm, yes. I'm, I'm having a little of Gaston. Yes, but you can still go slow. You have a she's speaking, hard She's She's speaking as Jan Perfect. Yes, you are doing good job, but go a little slow. <laughs> and uh, yeah, go ahead. Well, at any rate, whether I am looking for it or we are looking for it, the one thing that matters anyway is that I am looking for it for us. It's not for us, it's for your parents. You are simply trying to make me buy a villa so you can put your father and your mother in. You see, I know you. If you got what you want, you realize what will happen. You would spend the month of August in the villa, where your parents would take position of it every year from the beginning of April until the end of September. First of all, they would bring the whole time of your sister's children in there. No, I am very fond of your family, but not quite so fond of them. Uh, isn't that surprising that all over the globe, that's what the couples fight about? <laughs> <laughs> How come the French society and French people, and they have the similar topics to fight? And you will find the same topics in Indian family also. Then why have you been looking over villas for the past week? I don't even know that you have been bored. Well. Well what? Then stop being bored and buy one. That will finish it. We won't talk about it anymore. Exactly. As far as that goes, what of it? Suppose I do want to I do want to buy a villa for Papa and Mama. What of it? My darling. I quite admit that you want to buy a villa for your father. But please admit on your side that I don't want to pay for it. That is my dowry. There is my dowry. She says I have that money that was given to me by my parents. Your dowry, my poor child. We have spent that long. What, what, what dowry are there? <laughs> I know a very different dowry. Yeah, the dowry is the same thing that I am talking about. The dowry which the uh, like Isn't the dowry also the parents? Because yeah. the parents has to pay to the husband's family. Yeah. That's yeah, they give it to the girls. They give it to the girls also opposite. Yeah, they give it the daughter. Parents give it to the girls. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. 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 Yeah, the girl who is ideally the girl has a reason. She pays the husband's family. What do I understand? Yeah, and so in India, the husband's family and the husband takes it. Yeah. In this case, the they give it to the girl. A certain amount of money is given to her in her marriage. That's why. That's why I got confused. Yeah. So that would be a better, better way of if you want to give money, give it to your daughter rather than somebody else. But since then you have made a few fortune. What so I have, but you have. Anyway, but you shouldn't give dowry. It's illegal in India. But parents can give money to their child if they want to. If they, they, they want, want to, yeah. Nobody should demand or ask. What so I have, but you have. Anyway, there's no use discussing. I will not buy a villa and that kind of stuff. Then it wasn't worth worth coming in. That's exactly what I told you. In that case, let's go. By all means. What on earth will the lady think of us? I've never cared much about anybody's opinion. Come along. He takes his hat and goes towards the door at this moment, Juliet enters. Good afternoon, Madame. Monsieur. How do you do, Madame? Say it. That's my name. How do you do, Madame? Good day. Uh, won't you sit down? All three of them say. Uh, is your first impression a good one? Excellent. Should I say the Julius dialogue yeah, to avoid confusion? I'm not in the least surprised. 
It is the most delightful little place. Its appearance is modest, but it has a charm of its own. I can tell by just looking at you that it would suit your you and me admirably, as you suit it. If you will permit me to say so, coming from me, it may surprise you to hear that you already appear to be at home. The choice of a frame is not so easy when you have such a delightful pastel to place in it. She naturally indicates Jian, who is flattered. The house possesses a great many advantages. Electricity, gas, water, telephone and drainage. The bathroom is beautifully fitted and the roof was entirely repaired last year. Oh, that is very important, isn't it, darling? <laughs> the garden is not very large. It's not long and it's not wide. But... But my word is high. <laughs> that's really honest. Okay, that's not exactly what I meant. Your husband is very witty, madam. As I was saying, the garden is not very large, but you see, it is surrounded by other gardens. What's a garden? Okay. Um, but it's very hard, but it is high. Uh, I really have to think what it would be. Okay. It's not long and it's not wide, but, but my word, it is high. What's so that? Probably has a lot of meaning, but I can't. Yes, but even I really don't know because it's that old English and then setting in French. I think I nowadays means drunk. Yes, but then it's. The garden is not very large, it's not long, it's not wide, but. But the word. Because initially he did not like the garden at yeah. all. He said, what is this, a small patch? Um, I'd have to sign this. Okay. What the exact meaning here? What joke probably he's trying to you carry on? But the principle of people who like children and have a tell can always go and live near school. Please don't joke, Yasin. What this lady says is perfectly right. Will you tell me, Madam, what price you are asking for the villa? Well, you see, I must admit, quite frankly, that I don't want to sell it anymore. Gaston? Then there's nothing further to be said. Please, no. <clears throat> Please, I. Let Madam finish, my dear. Thank you. I was going to say that for exceptional people like you, I don't mind giving it up. One arranges a house in accordance with one's own taste. If you understand what I mean, to suit oneself as it were, so one would not like to think that ordinary people had come to live in it. But to you, I can see with perfect assurance, I agree. Yes, I will sell it to you. It's extremely kind of you. Extremely, yes. But uh, was surprised. You will never believe it. I believe in God, so you see. <laughs> Entirely furnished with all the luxuries, uh, all the picture, pictures, just as it is, with the exception of that one little picture signed by Garrett. I don't know if you have ever heard of that painter, have you? No. <laughs> Neither have I. But I like the color and I want to keep it, if you don't mind. For the villa itself, just as it stands, 250,000 flats. I repeat that I would much rather dispose of it at the less than its value to people like yourself than to give it up even for more money to someone whom I didn't like. The price must be decidedly excessive. Oh no! Oh, oh yes, madam. Well, really, I must say, I'm Quite so, that is full of surprises. <laughs> you think it there at 250,000? Very well. I can't be fairer than this. Make me an offer. If I dare, it would be much less than that. Make it anyway. It's very awkward. I. Make some figures, darling, just to 
please me. Well, I hardly know. Sixty thousand. Oh. Oh. What do you mean by oh? Because it isn't worth more than that. I give you my word of honor, Monsieur. I cannot let it go for less than two hundred thousand. You have got the right to do as you please, ma'am. I tell you what. I will do. I will be philanthropic and let you have it for two hundred thousand. And I'll be equally good natured and very keep it to the same price. <laughs> In that case, there is nothing more to be said, Monsieur. Good day. One minute, darling. Before you tell me to decide, I would love you to go over the upper floor with me. I will show it to you with the greatest pleasure. This way, man. This way, Monsieur. No, thank you. Really, I have made up my mind. I am not very fond of climbing stairs. Just as you wish, Monsieur. To Jia, shall I lead the way? If you please, Madam. Exit, Julie. You are not over polite, are you? Oh, my darling. For heaven's sake, stop going on this channel. Go and examine the bathroom and come back on Tuesday. So he calls this villa a shanty. Shanty is a small, uh, you can say, a hut. Hut, yeah, a hut or a very small, poorly furnished house. Okay, now so there is Captain you. and then there is Mrs. Alsmith. So the most of the dialogues are between Captain and Mrs. Alsmith. So I'll just say maybe is that Captain. Yeah, Who's an Alsmith? Mrs. Al Smith is this American, rich American lady who just works because they have, she has put the same villa for sale uh, sign. So she has also come to see the villa. Okay, so now, yeah, so now Juliet and Jian have gone on the first floor to see the rooms above. And there is only the maid and the Gaston. A uh, maid also goes, and I think it's the Hawkey maid is there. Gaston and Mrs. Al Smith walks. Two hundred thousand for a few years of that. She must be thinking I'm crazy. The doorbell rings, and a moment later, later the maid re-enters, showing in Mrs. Alex Smith. Okay, it's the maid only. No, no, no. Yeah. See, the maid the enters, maid. showing in Mrs. Alex Smith. Like she brings in Mrs. Alex Smith. The maid re-enters. Yeah. So maid re-enters. This is a play. The maid re-enters the stage. Yeah, okay. on the stage. Showing in Mrs. Alex. To show in someone means to bring in someone. Oh, I thought it's the maid. If Madam would be kind enough to come in. See here. Now I tell you, I am funny. How much do How much do they want for this house? I don't know anything about it, Madam. To start off with, why isn't the price marked on the signboard? You French people have a cute way of doing business. You go and tell your boss that if he doesn't come right away, I am good. I haven't any time to waste. Any hold up makes me say when I want something, it goes up. Oh, you are the husband. I suppose. Good afternoon. Do you speak American? Sure, you better. You better. He's trying to speak American English. That goes by. How much for this house? How much? Uh, okay, he assumes that uh, it's her uh, husband. She assumes she, he is the owner. How much? Well, when do you sit down? I do think standing up. Oh, do you? Yes, where's your wife? My wife. Oh, she does that. Well, she can stay there unless you have to lunch at home before you make a sale. Me? Not on your life. You are the exception. French men usually have to consult about 10 people before they get on a move. Get a move on. Listen, do you or don't you want to sell this house? I? Oh, I love You see, then what about it? I have it more than 5 minutes to spare. Sit down for three or nine to begin with the This is our spirit by my grandfather. I'm sure. What? 
She said, I have only five minutes. So sit down okay. for three. So she said, three minutes. So sit down for three hours. So why is it better than this? Is it like that? Read the full story. Then you. Why is it saying that it is the builder and grandfather? Because she says, no, is this your villa? He doesn't say anything. Are you the husband? He says, I'm the husband. Where's your wife? She's upstairs. So the conversation goes on. I don't care about the grandfather. Where do I? But I must tell that. Uh, Listen, just tell me the price. Let me explain that. No. We have electricity, gas, telephone. I don't care. What's the price? But you must go over the house. No. I want to knock it down and build a bungalow here. Oh, I see. Yeah, it's the land I want. I have to be near Paramount where I'm going to shoot some films. Oh. Let us read now uh, that thing. It's just a show. What? What? I am telling you, just read. You want to understand this part again? Yeah. Okay. So there is uh, this Mrs. Al Smith. She enters. Okay. And this maid, no, she tells that she first asks the maid, How much is this villa? She says, She doesn't know. So she says, go call your boss. Now when she says, call your boss, she doesn't know who the boss is. Is that a lady or a man? Okay. So go call your boss and tell him that I'm here. So she goes inside, the maid goes inside. As the as Mrs. Al uh, Smith enters the room, she sees Mr. Gaston. She asks, oh, so are you the, um, is this, uh, how much is this house for? So she wonders. So she doesn't. No, no. It's not that. See, she assumes that he's the owner. He never denies anything. He says, "How much is this house for?" So he says, "How much?" He's never saying that this is his house. See, he ha has he ever said? Yes, he, he never lied. He, he never lied. His wife is actually upstairs. Yeah. She has. He, he has said. Well, he didn't lie. He said he was built by his grandfather. Yeah, but then later, later, first she asks, "Where is your wife?" So he says she's upstairs. His wife was actually upstairs. So well, she can stay there unless you have to consult before you make a sale. So he says, no, not on your life. I don't consult my wife before making any sale. He himself was a businessman. Okay, and had made a great uh, fortune in his business. Was a rich businessman. So, uh, so he here he says she says, oh, Frenchmen usually have to consult five six big people. Before they make any deal, before they go ahead with anything, it's good that you don't have to consult anyone. So, uh, so he says, "How much do you want to sell this house for?" So, would you like to sell? I said, "I." Well, I think I understood. I I'd love to. Don't read it. Yeah. I understand. Go ahead. I want to ask for it. Yeah. Then okay. Now I. Now he starts saying that oh you know you sit. Let me tell you about the house to pretend as if this is the house. Now he starts pretending that it is this house. Can I point out those things in the city or put it in? Yes. They write, uh, you know, like, oh, they write as Kia. They even pronounce uh, it like, like butter, they pronounce it butcha. And like this, when I was there, uh, I was filling, the filling between the uh, two words, they write, oh, uh, they write as Kia. Kia is, you know, he's not saying, ah, uh, we say, ah, uh,
Bilang saya dengar, cekal saya. Dia punya seorang mereka di luar mana. Nampakkan sekarang dulu dia orang bersepada. Jatuh saya, you ought to learn how to do this. We are learning now, we are practicing. When then, how much? The house, let me see. I should say 300,000 francs, the same price we do. Even there are men that haven't been up with the price. Treat me the same as anybody. Then you say... Then you say it is 300,000? Since you're here. Since you're here. Since you're here. Huh? I don't understand. <laughs> He's talking to himself. He's talking, since you are a dear bot, I will love you, dear. I am. So he's talking to himself. Yeah. But what do you, well, I don't understand what he said to him. Uh, treat me the same as anybody. Then you say it is, uh, then you say it is 300,000. Yeah, I understand. So, since you are dear, what? I will love you, dear. So she is probably saying that to his wife. That, oh dear, since you bought me here. But this is what, not brought. Since you are dear, what? I will love you, dear. That doesn't, that doesn't make grammatical sense. Yeah, I know. It, it's not grammatical. I don't, I don't understand. Since you are dear, what? Since you are dear, what? Is it? I will love you. Huh? <laughs> okay, this time. Yeah. See, what do you take me for? Sorry, that's Shakespeare. I mean, cash. Now, I get you. Cash comes. See, you're coming on. She takes her checkbook from her back. Uh, wait, I never know where they put my bag. Uh, let me tell you something. You'd better buy yourself a fountain pen with the money you get for the villa. What day is it today? The 24th. Oh, yeah, sorry. The 24th. You can fill in your name on the check yourself. I live at the Ritz Hotel place when my lawyer is. Who? Exactly. What? My lawyer is Mr. Who. I do be careful. He will get in touch with yours about the rest of the transaction. Goodbye. Goodbye. When are you leaving? Well, uh, I don't quite know. When are you leaving? Make it tomorrow and the architect can come on Thursday. Goodbye. I will be like it. Delighted to be She goes and deals with it. It's a very good thing in business. Why are you doing business? No, I understand. I understand. I understand. He and is going to buy the house for 200,000 and then sell it to her for 300,000. Yeah. And he's going to make a profit of 100,000 pounds. Do you understand it? Why are you No, it's, I, I, it's not obvious. That's what it is. That's, you asked me why is he doing this. I'm not saying I didn't want it to know. <laughs> I'm explaining He just what said that was an expression. Why is he doing this? I'm explaining what, what is that. I'm not saying anything that's happening here. I have a dead cup. Yeah, this is this is the most obvious thing that I have. Taking this from what I've read, what we have read this far, I'm not. I'm not. I'm not. I'm spoiling it. So at that moment, Gian and Juliet return. What were they doing upstairs? Well, of course, it's very charming. Of course, as I told you, it's not a large place. I warned you, there are two large bedrooms and one small one. Well, well now, that's something. Well now, that's something. Suddenly, his tone has changed. Yeah. <laughs> to her husband. To her husband. You are quite right, darling. And I'm afraid it would not be suitable. Thank you, madam. We need not uh, keep you any longer. Oh, that's quite all right. Just one. Just one. Okay. He said I have two large bedrooms as well. Yes. And two servants' rooms. Yes. Oh, sorry. Oh, and two, uh, there are two servants rooms in addition, are there? Yes. Does it serve? Gaston's, uh, am I, okay, Gaston, stop joking. And the bathroom, what's that like? Perfect. There's a bath in it. Oh, there's a bath in the bathroom, what's that? Oh, good, there is. <laughs> it's all very important, a bathroom with a bath in it. Bedrooms. 
to the light at once more. Let the servants room to the guard. It's really possible for him. Perhaps you have anything at all about your bar. You see? It goes low. Yeah. While you were upstairs, I think. Should I read that immediately? Yeah, yeah. It's all very important. A bathroom with a bathroom. Bedrooms, two large and one small. Two servants, rooms, and a guard. It's really possible. While you were upstairs, I've been thinking a lot about your papa and us. You see, I'm really unsettled, and then the rooms were your sister's children. Also, my dear, I've been thinking, and this is serious, about her old age. It's bound to come sooner or later, and then I'll tell you that there are old age. The quiet country life. You said 200,000, didn't you? What on earth are you going to that? Just trying to raise it your child. Yes, 200,000 is my lowest cash, of course. Well, that's it. I won't argue with that. It takes up time. It takes a rest of time. But there are so many things to be discussed before. No, no, no. Only one thing. As I'm not arguing about the price. As I'm not abandoning with you, well, it must be nice with you. You must allow me to keep this little picture of this carefully company while you and my wife are subscribers. It's not a question of value. Certainly not, just as a souvenir. Very well, you may keep it. Thank you, madam. Believe me, I receive these, a large will draw the reader for the This will end in the It's a 23rd, isn't it? No, the 24th. Why does it matter? One day more of us. He's asked to see an engineer as a correct step. Thank you, Monsieur. Here's my car. Gaston, better give me your car. Goodbye, madam. Oh, by the way, you'll be kind enough to leave tomorrow morning. Tomorrow? So soon? We'll say tomorrow evening at the least. Yes, I can manage that. Goodbye, madam. Good, good day, madam. I'll take my little picture as well, if you don't mind. You are not. Just a beautiful subject. Huh? <coughs> oh, very well. I'll show you the garden on the way out. Is it too late? <coughs> what on earth have you done? I? I made a hundred thousand francs and I had it. But how? I tell you later. See, <laughs> so this, this is the most big brain plan I've ever seen. This man is so smart. What's a carrot? Are you carrot that painting of a carrot? Carrot is the, uh, what do you call it? The, the painter. painter. The name of the, the painter. We finished it. Yes. We did. Okay, the I name of the painter was carrot. carrot. No, and it makes sense if I said it. It doesn't mean if I have to explain it as a normal carrot. It's just five minutes left. Yeah, just five minutes left. How is it even possible? I don't expect one minute to be but you understood the story. It's a, it's a very interesting, very nice. It's, it's really funny. Funny yeah. story. <laughs> and the dialogues are also very interesting. <laughs> you know, they're plain, but there is that subtle humor. You no know, sarcasm. <laughs> there are many jokes. You can tell that Gaston is a businessman. Yeah. How could he even decide on the spot? <laughs> So he, when he realized that uh, uh, Al Smith was a big star, he realized that he, he had a chance. He didn't you know, his chance to make a profit. So he proposed 300,000 francs and she accepted it. Yes. And then he bought the hospital. <laughs> he, 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 he worked very fast. Then. Okay, you can do this question number five. Read the following extract and answer the questions that follow by choosing the correct options. Why is the date expired? But the sign has been hanging on the gate for over a month now and I'm beginning to be afraid that the day I bought it was when I was the real thing. See, I had to find a suitable buyer for it. Yeah. Why is Julia disappointed? See, I had to find a suitable buyer for yeah. Why? Why does she call herself a fool? She had bought the villa from more than it was. Okay. Also see. But you're trying to take a look. Now, let me mark the next one. Okay, I want to take a look at this one. My parents have said they stay with them for a long time. 
ಒಳ್ಳೆ ರೆಸ್ಪಾನ್ಸಿಬಿಲಿಟಿ ಒಳ್ಳೆ ಬಿಲ್ ಮಾಡ್ ಬ್ಯಾಸ್ಟ್ ಸರ್ ಅಡ್ಗೆ ಮಾಡ್ತಾ ಇದೀವಿ ಸಾರಿ ಸರ್ ಅಲ್ಲೇ ಇದೆ ನಾನು ಮಾಡಿದ ಎಕ್ಸ್‌ಪೆನ್ಸ್ ಸೇವದೆ ಮಾ ನಾನು ಎಕ್ಸ್‌ಪೆನ್ಸ್ ಸರ್ ಇಟ್ಸ್ ಆನ್ ಅಲ್ಲೇ ಇದೆ ಎಕ್ಸ್‌ಪೆನ್ಸ್ ಸೇವದೆ ಮಾ ನಾನು ಎಕ್ಸ್‌ಪೆನ್ಸ್ ಸರ್ what is this uh, what is the above statement in the lord cast this character he is an opportunist true he is an opportunist what is the above statement reveal about cast this character he is an opportunist hmm. yes answer for the person why does he not to buy a villa he has to buy a villa for a pair of pants why does he want to buy a villa primarily for a pair okay for a pair to spend some months yeah with them why is that not just to find the villain because he was he, 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 he was not interested in buying a villa in the first place and uh, he thought it was a uh, very expensive yeah he never and also he, he didn't even like the uh, villa from the starting and didn't like what they called it the card it was after this small so he did not like the villa that was for sale He didn't want to buy. A, sorry. He never even wanted to buy. Yeah, so much. Yeah, he never wanted to buy a villa. He didn't like the villa. And uh, and uh, he did not like the idea that her pet, that his wife's parents would come and occupy the villa for a long and time and spend the summer with him. And he didn't want to spend the money. Yes. Miss Sarah makes many statements for the friends. They got an interaction. What a pity you don't try and copy us more. Europeans go to America to earn money, and Americans come to. That means gas is there. Gas is there. But it's the same meaning of it. Ah. Uh, Mrs. Alston makes many statements about the yeah, French. Yeah, today today Alston. Because they need to prove and explain them. Juliet says, "Oh, and explain them." There is. Do you do love your grandmother's cinema? Or do you hope? Or uh, you think about the past all the time, and we always think about the future. Right. That is also there. That Europeans are very proud of their history. Okay. Uh, you French people have a cute way of doing business. Now, how will you explain that? Ah, uh, well, they uh, don't have the price marked on the signboard, and then um, they uh, have to consult uh, like ten people before they can finally. Tell the price of the house. So you always say that. Um, you don't explain. How many to one explain that? Yeah, so we can say that you French people are people who do this. Then explain that a they don't have the sign, um, the price part of the sign board. B uh, um, they have to consult a lot of people before finally they can uh, reveal what the price they are going to. Okay. Uh, so. Here, but you can. This is easy to explain. You think about the past all the time. We always think about the future. Isn't this also French? So, so yeah, the captain says everybody thinks about what he's got. French people usually have to consult about ten people. Yeah, so I'm not that one. They get. Yeah. I right. think that. So they are, uh, or they can. You can say that they have. They are close with family members, and they consult. Very funny. Yes. For me, the funniest part is that there is a bath in the bathroom. Ah, <laughs> yeah. um, Juliet says, "Dash, now I have only one thought that is to get the wretched place off my hands. I would sacrifice it at any price." Does she stick to her words? Why? Yes. Why? She, she doesn't. She doesn't. She doesn't. She doesn't. She, doesn't. she, doesn't. she, she, she ends up selling it for like two hundred. She wants to. She wanted two hundred fifty thousand and the buyer came. No, but she, she had to sacrifice it at any price. At any price, she would. She would sacrifice. She was saying, but she did not give what the. What she was saying and to her maid was that she would uh, give it for even one hundred thousand, and then she uh, asked two hundred fifty thousand. She didn't give her. Yeah, she asked for two hundred thousand. She doesn't stick to her. Well, she yeah, ended up asking for two hundred fifty thousand. Two hundred fifty thousand. Two hundred fifty or two hundred. Two hundred fifty thousand. Two hundred fifty thousand. But she. Uh, but she had told her. She had told her maid that she would give it at any price, even a hundred thousand. So like, yeah, she does not. So does she stick to her words? No, she does not. When Gaston comes 
she offered the offering price was 250000 later she reduced it for 200000 but she had told her man that she would be available up even for this yeah. uh, uh, which she did not see and why does she not uh, sacrifice why did she not put the uh, lesser cost um, because she can she can share my own what is so to get a fair and if I she wanted to get a good product does she stick to her words easily? And the next question is why? Why not? Because when she offered, when she asked for 200,000, she did get that amount of money. Basically, she, she ended up changing her mind and she didn't want, she wanted to make a good uh, bargain. Ba ba bargain out of it. And she didn't want to just give it up for any price. Yes. So she did not want to give up at any cost. And she wanted she a, her mind. Yeah, she wanted a um, villa to be sold at a decent price or a price of her life. She didn't want it to? She didn't want to sell at any price. It's not she didn't want it. You don't use double passes. She didn't want to sell at lower price. Though she was ready to bargain. 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 She didn't want to sell it for lower price and 200,000 was the price she stuck to. Thousand was the price she demanded. Hello. Hello. Ah, we'll discuss the remaining later. I don't show you the next chapter is this place. We will do the solid in this. I was saying that can we take double classes next time we can publish it? Oh yeah, what will I do? <laughs> yeah, what my English exam went so well. Good. There was okay, there was not a single mistake in the MCQs, not in the question answers. I matched everything right now. There's a hundred and thirty four. Hopefully I'm getting above forty five. Is 134 paragraphs. Why would you count the paragraphs? They have it counted in the books. So that's what I'm saying. It could be a double class. Class X, 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 X,